They were called cowboys, rebels, mavericks, revolutionaries. They weren't test pilots or gonzo journalists, pop art painters or rock and roll renegades, but they had the same spirit of defiance in the face of the predictable, the expected, the status quo. They were innovators whose work helped shape life as we know it. They were IBM storage technology engineers who set in motion 50 years of disk system innovation. Okay, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking rebels, cowboys working for IBM. You're thinking IBM isn't that kind of company. All right, well, consider this. It's 1952. A little band of big thinkers detaches itself from the mothership and sets up shop on the left coast. They're led by a bona fide genius named Reynold Johnson. Their mission, as dictated by the purportedly uptight institution that was IBM, make something cool. How rock and roll is that? Those guys could have done anything they wanted. Maybe concocted some rocket shoes or some kind of invisibility hat. But instead, they thought about where technology was, where it had been, where it was going. They shook the world by its lapels and said, tell me what you need. And the world said, you know, I could really use a new way to store information. So they did it. These rebels with a cause cooked up a totally different way of thinking about storage, man. They called it the disk system. And it was good. In 1956, computers like the IBM Ramac 305 could say goodbye to punch cards, so long latency associated with sequential access because the disk system was here to blow their vacuum tube minds. It was faster denser, more reliable, and had something the world had never seen before. Random access. Okay, by today's standards, it had its limitations. It was the size of a couple of refrigerators and held five megabytes of storage, enough to store a low-res scan of the Mona Lisa. A cutting-edge disk system today, like the IBM DS8000, could store high-res scans of all the paintings in the Louvre, Hermitage, and Guggenheim combined. But the IBM Ramek 305 was the start of something big. A revolution that wasn't just about storing information, it was about being able to manage it and access it any way you want. They kicked off the information age where we can tap into all the knowledge, entertainment, research, and discoveries we can handle because it's all out there spinning around on millions of interconnected disk systems. What they've given us is technology that matters. Technology that makes it easier to do our jobs, that makes the world go round, that makes our lives better. And that never settle for less attitude that started everything is still making noise at the heart of IBM. Just look at the latest offerings from IBM System Storage. Like the IBM DS8000 with approximately 38 million times the capacity of the IBM Ramac 305 featuring the latest in storage technology innovations like virtualization, mirroring capabilities, enormous capacity, and a wide variety of software packages. What matters is making it easier to retrieve and manage information so that everyone can reach into an ocean of information and pull out what they want when they want it. And that is the future of storage. One company, more than any other, is poised to take us there. So turn it up and play it loud. Meet the groundbreakers, the movers and shakers, the action takers, the innovators dedicated to bringing you another 50 years of mind-blowing innovation that matters from IBM.